an association of Kogi professional women has called on all women in Kogi state to come out en masse to vote during the elections. The media appeal at the press briefing in Abuja, citing violence as one of the reasons for low turnout during elections. Abida Lawal has the details. Women's representation in Nigerian politics has been on a downward slide since 2011, and the 2023 elections in Africa's largest economy confirmed the expectations of poor outcomes for women. The number of women in Nigeria's National Assembly has fallen by 19% compared to last Assembly, with women now occupying 3% of seats in the Senate and 4% in the House of Representatives. The Kogi Professional Women Association is rooting for the candidate of the All Progressives Congress, Usman Ududu. It stated the inclusion of women in governance in the state as one of its reasons for supporting him. First of its kind in the history of the state, all local government chairmen have deputy chairmen that were women. Mm -hmm. It was a law, it was a rule, and not only women, women from the grassroots. Mm. It's a, it's a different thing to import we, like professionals like us, to say, come home and come and take this space. No, mm -hmm. he improved that by picking women in the grassroots. Mm -hmm. So that is something that we appreciate. And not only that, even within his cabinet, he helped women. Mm -hmm. He put women in position. In Nigeria, women suffer high attrition rate throughout the electoral circle and face significant and distinct challenges in each phase most especially violence during election, where women are mostly the victims. Because our elections in Nigeria has always been marred by violence, therefore discouraging a lot of us, especially with the weaker yes, sex, from coming, out from coming out to vote. We are appealing, Kogi professional women, they are, we are appealing to all candidates across board. Please talk to your supporters. We don't want violence. Stop allowing our children to get involved in violence. Since 2019, Nigeria's political space has seen some recent overhauls. The 2023 election has proven that the use of bimodal voter accreditation system has come to stay. Habida Lawao, TVC News, Abuja.